fellow bug girl here hey. has never had Ferrero Rochers. And um, I just so happened to have an entire collection. About so a I, thousand. So I figured we'd um, capture this moment on camera. Crack it open. Like this. Look how much Cornell swag I have right now. Look. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Cornell, Cornell. I Ever bought two other sweatshirts as if I didn't already have like seven. So oh, now really? I have like ten. Yep. Well, nine, but you know, math. Good. Okay, ready? Oh, Olivia. Yes. Um, what R value do they use in the delta G equals negative RT? <laughs> Five. Five wait, X. Wait, wait. Do they use the eight, the eight point two or whatever? Or also, want to know my exciting life? No, that's the bathroom. How lovely. This. <laughs> The work does not stop, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. So on the inside is like a little ball of hazelnut and Nutella. Mm. Do you smell it already? Ow. And <laughs> Sorry, I just like smacked your face. Oh, it just looks so beautiful. This is what I like to call... This one. When, how mad would that make you? A little mad. It's like... Ready? Mm hmm Click on, I'm gonna take this one. Oh, oh. just kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. That bothers me. Oh my god. Oh my god. Now you took it, so now you gotta do it. No, oh, okay, no, no, okay, no. Okay. It's perfect. Okay. But this one looks small. I'll take it. They're all the same size. It's like mass produced. How do I like eat individually it? made? Oh, yeah, whip this up. Yeah, yeah. I just brushed my teeth, so I can't have any. And also, I can't have sugar before bedtime. Otherwise, I'll go crazy. Ready? You already oh, are like, crazy. I know. What's on my shirt? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, bug juice. Yeah, bug juice, probably. Okay, just put the whole thing in your mouth. Oh, the whole thing? Yeah. How big do you think my mouth is? It's literally not hard at all. The whole thing! What's wrong with you? <laughs> what the hell is this? The thing. <laughs> what are you thinking right <laughs> Maybe like a religious experience. Whoa. <laughs> it's like creamy, but then there's nuts. It's nuts. <laughs> All right, bug girl, bye. My arm hair. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that wasn't so bad. <laughs> it got really hairy there for the hair, you get it? You pass what? I passed out like literally. If I don't pass out in a year, it's weird. In a year? Yeah, like I pass out every year. I pass out when I eat pass out every year. Yeah, I pass out a lot. I pass out in the bathtub. I pass out in the bathtub. I pass out in the bathtub. Like, Dehydration, low blood sugar. Just when like God wants to shoot me down. What? Wait, what? I just pass out. That's scary. No? No, it's healthy. Is healthy. Is no healthy. I just Anna's saying she passes out about 14 times a year. Pass and we're saying that maybe she should go to the doctor. And she's telling us that she has gone to the doctor and they said nothing's wrong. I do not do well with like blood or like even Yeah, me either though. Oh, you're gonna have to go to the doctor. Yeah, I mean, yeah, they're gonna be not see what happens now. <laughs> <laughs> Shay has seen. <laughs> She's obsessed with like the reality shows. So For example, so what is it? Ew. Gypsy Wedding? They had a sister wedding. It's so embarrassing. <laughs> and they had a fight because they both wanted to be dressed bigger than the other. Stuffed my face with ice cream, as per usual, because I'm an ice cream enthusiast. If you don't follow me on Instagram, it's at Simply Sleep. My bio is ice cream enthusiast, and I stick to it, especially since coming here. But today we're going to the Ithaca Farmer's Market, so I don't really know what's going to be there. Sorry that it's like kind of loud, I'm in a dining hall. But we're just going to some friends. Honestly, I don't know if I'm going to get anything. It's just like to go explore Ithaca a little bit. I'm here with lovely Catherine, and that's the scoop. That car's gonna splash you. <laughs> All right, go. Yeah, like, 
Okay guys, so this is like the cutest place ever and Catherine just got her own little plant and I think I'm gonna get myself a bouquet of flowers because I usually get my mom flowers on Fridays actually Aww. and or she gets them for herself so I think I might just do that for myself now and like whenever we go out like I just get myself some flowers but it is such a cute environment here and I love it. It's gonna be Anna's dog pretty soon. <laughs> <laughs> and it's gonna find like a replica of this dog. No matter how hard I try. And I may never understand how every single day we breathe 23,000 times. Cause watching your chest rise and fall. This part's loud. <laughs> Keep going. Those numbers don't add up when all yours A hundred trillion cells, two hundred and six bones Five quarts of blood, forty-five miles of nerves, nerves, nerves And a hundred thousand pairs and too many organs Sixty thousand miles of arteries We must have been made by a man Cause a woman would have made us more economically I don't know what that means All I know is that I've seen this scene Some years ago I'm done <laughs> Woo! That's so good! Yes, yeah. Shay! <laughs> I don't know <laughs> More photos! <laughs> so you will be a bridezilla <laughs> What if I will be a... <laughs> no! Behind the Insta photo Oh, oh, dear. oh dear. <laughs> See, that's exactly why I I feel exposed. Yep. We came to see the movie It. The scary movie. Look at my highlight. Yeah, she has a good Guess highlight. how much? Three dollars. And so, um, we're here to see the movie It. We are very nervous. I'm, I'm not. To I, typically, I typically do watch scary movies. I don't really get affected I by don't. them anymore. I will cry. But now I'm like really nervous because I feel like it, it is going to be... A little we intense. We'll almost be 50 years old. 30 We're built years off the back of this slaves. Year old Replicants are the future, but I can only make so many. Anna's very scared, so she's just talking about it. I'm so sorry. All they can show me is scary advertisements. I think you found it. Scary movies from Seth Mayer. Oh my god, this bug. It just gets out. <laughs> Update, it's now like, what time is it? What time is it? 420 blazing. What time is it? It's, it's now almost 1 a.m. and we're waiting for an Uber and honestly, I didn't like the movie. It wasn't because it was scary. It just wasn't that scary. Okay, let's see. Where are we? It was just gory, unnecessarily long. I'm tired. And I thought I could have just seen this Reese Witherspoon movie and have been happier. But you know what? It is what it is. Hey. Good morning, everyone. It is Celine here. I have not vlogged in a month. And I have no excuses other than the fact that I have been studying and just going to the library so I didn't see the point in just kind of showing you guys like me going up this hill sweating to death and then just sitting in the library for four hours. But today is really exciting because I'm going with my speech and debate team to go to Washington DC because there is a tournament for the speech and debate team like across, you know, various states. And so I've been on the speech and debate team here and it's definitely challenging, it's a little intense but uh, I'm excited to see where this takes me and how this tournament goes and for the bus ride. So I figured I'd just take you guys along with me, at least to see like behind the scenes because I don't think I'm gonna be vlogging at all during the actual tournament because I'm gonna be so like stressed from trying to do everything. So for this event specifically, uh, Technically, I'm supposed to be doing extemporaneous speaking, which is basically when you walk into a room and the judge gives you three political questions. So it could be anything that happened like within that day. It could be anything that's been going on recently. And it'll, it could be like a how, like how do you think um, this should be resolved. It could be a yes, no question. It could be what should the government do. So there's different types of political questions that you have to figure out answers to and you use sources from the internet. So like according to the New York Times, 
uh, blah 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 and then you basically just say like your solutions on the issue so that's one of the forms of speaking I'm going to be doing the second is called persuasive speaking which is like pre-memorized uh, mine is not yet memorized I am in the process of doing that and basically you just pick an argument um, so you find a topic first of all and then you make an argument out of that topic and then you just give like a 10 minute speech on all of your like the problems and uh, like the causes the effects solutions so it's just been a challenging thing to be a part of and i honestly joined it because i wanted to be challenged and i wanted to learn more about the world of politics so anyways i will see you guys later hello everyone so i am with my roommate slash fellow speech friend Bree, <laughs> and we just got ready and we are getting ready to go to the tournament we are currently in dc yep. It was a eight hour bus ride, well van yeah. ride rather. Yeah. A and huge, um, huge van. <laughs> yep. So we have been practicing our speeches and trying our best not to die in the process. Yeah. But um trying I'd say we're it. trying trying to memorize, yep. I mean the yeah. we, tournament is here. We're probably <laughs> performing in like, you know, a couple hours, but um hmm. it'll be we'll it it'll goes. be fine. Yeah. If I don't cry today, it'll be a good thing. But <laughs> Um, if we could just get through the day. Exactly. It'd and then <laughs> we have tomorrow, which is the second day for the tournament. So, um, yeah. Yep. 